and welcome to the next instalment of this Beginners Kettlebell Programme Series. Following on from the upper body workouts we have done, we're now going to be concentrating on the lower body. What we have for you today is a classic or traditional Beginners Kettlebell Workout. And what we're going to be doing is, we're going to be starting off slow and through the weeks, we're going to be gradually increasing the reps, exercises, and maybe tweaking them a little bit as well. But what we have for you today is seven exercises in total, and we're going for two rounds as ever. Shouldn't be too much of a long workout, but anyway, let's get started. First things first, we're going to do single leg raises just to strengthen our ankles a little bit, get used to that balance, get a bit of coordination in there, and also obviously work our quads a little bit. So, here we go. We're going to go for 10 raises on each side. Nice and easy. Obviously you can feel a little bit of a wiggle there, but again, just getting used to that balance. Ten, nice and easy. Good start. Next what we're gonna be doing is kettlebell swings. I know we're working the lower body and the swings obviously work the upper part of the body but as you all know with the kettlebell swing we're thrusting with the hips and they also work the quads and the hamstrings. So 20 of these please. There we go. Whew. Next, we're going on to goblet squats, as we'll see here. Now what you can do with these is, either hold the kettlebell by the horns, or you can hold the kettlebell by the bell itself. And what we want to do today is hold it by the kettlebell itself. We're gonna go for 20 of these. sitting in there because you could probably hear the knees. Next we're going on to reverse lunge. As we step back with one leg and step back up again, we're going to be alternating the legs. So 20 in total, 10 on each side.
swinging. Whew. Now we're going on to deadlift. As we're doing here, picking up the kettlebell, coming up. As you will see here, 20 of these, here we go. Next we're going on to calf raises. Twenty of these. Now, probably something like this. Onto your toes. Down. Probably stand like this. Or stand like this. Now I struggle with these because I have a bunion. So every time I go to stand up feet go out to the side naturally so I have to concentrate even harder to bring my foot up straight. Here we go, 20 please. Finally for this round, we're going on to hip thrusters. Placing the kettlebell on the abdominal region. Twenty of these, please. That's the end of the first round, let's get straight into the second round. Leg raises, 10 on each side. Kettlebell swing, 20.
20. Now back to goblet squat. 20 please. Okay, reverse squat, reverse lunge even, apologies. Here we go, 20. Now back to calf raises. Finally, last exercise I'm ready, hip thrusters. Excuse me for that, trapped air underneath my back. Whew, here we go. 20 please. There you go, workout done. That only took around 15 minutes to complete. Nice and easy to get you used to the lower body using kettlebells. 
as I said, as we progress through the weeks, we're gonna increase the reps, increase the exercises, so that as you're working out with kettlebells in the future, you're gonna have no problem after having a solid foundation from working through these workouts. If you check the description below, you'll see the previous workouts in this kettlebell workout series. But now, that's pretty much it. So, until the next workout, take care. Bye-bye.